Hey everybody, welcome back to Magic Orthodoxy. My name is David and this is a Magic Review. Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to Magic Time. Magic Time is fun. We like magic, you like it, I like it. We should be best buds. We should be. We should be best buds and best buds would click like. Best Buds would click subscribe, I'm just saying. If you like magic, if you like playing cards, if you like reviews of those things, do me a solid, click all the buttons that let me know that you appreciate what I do. Today, we're looking at Punked from Paul Carnazzo. If you've been watching my channel for any amount of time, you know I am a huge fan of Paul's, done a ton of reviews for him, uh, stuff I've bought with my own money, stuff he sent me, uh, it's gone back and forth. He's a great, great guy. Uh, I'm really into mentalism. That's one of my, one of my passions and Paul's too. Paul's put out some of the best, strongest mentalism up at least, uh, two or three of his items are on my person at all time. Uh, most of them in my wallet. He makes so many great everyday carries. I cannot recommend mentalvoyage.com enough. And today, wow. This is the biggest, baddest, boldest, awesomest trick I have seen from him yet. What is Punked? Punked is the classic toothpick through matchbox trick. You start off with a matchbox. It's punctured with nine toothpicks going all the way through. Spectators can even see the toothpicks slide back and forth. When I do this, I have the spectator remove the toothpicks themselves because I want them to see that they really are going all the way through. Once all the toothpicks are out, you slide the matchbox drawer out and out flops a solid brass block. That brass block can be inspected, handed out. They'll never find a thing. Mouths agape, people fainting on the floor, children offering to mow your lawn. It's that awesome. All right, so the questions, the questions we always ask. Let's say you pay your $125 to mentalvoyage.com. What are you gonna get? You are gonna get a nice box. Inside that, you're gonna get every single thing you need. Paul's hooking you up. You're gonna get the brass block. You're gonna get a pre-punched matchbox. You're gonna get real matches. You're gonna get fake matches. You're gonna get toothpicks. And you're gonna get a carrying case to put all of this in and the download code, which gives you access to 25 minutes of instruction. Is it what I thought? Well, yes, it is what I thought, but that is beside the point. He's not trying to fool me. He's trying to fool the spectator, right? Now, as a magician, I've been privy to this secret for a while. Uh, and so, I mean, yeah, but it doesn't matter. Let's put it this way. Um, as soon as I got this, learned it, figured it out, I showed it to my wife, right? And my wife has seen a ton of magic tricks, tons. It's really hard to fool her or surprise her. She saw this and she was beside herself. She said, this, this thing was awesome. So uh, if, it, if it blew away a magician's wife, come on, it's gonna floor your spectators. Is it well made? Very well made. And that is why uh, the price is so high. There are some incredibly um, beautifully expensive machine made items in this. What's the overall quality and production value of the video? You got Paul, he's in his magic office. There's a curtain backdrop. It's mostly a straight on shot, but you do get a few close-ups. As far as what he's gonna teach you, you'll get an intro. He'll talk about the history of the effect. He's gonna walk you through the setup and of the 25 minutes, a lot of the video is going to be getting your gimmicks ready for your very first presentation. And I would say, don't rush this part. I know you wanna to get to the magic part, don't rush it. Follow these instructions and do the work. Figure out why this works. Then he's gonna walk you through a few presentation ideas and then you have an outro. Pocket space, pocket space, the matchbox itself is small, right? Small, small toothpicks. But you're gonna put it all together as the puzzle first. So you're gonna do that behind the scenes. You're, you're walking out with the toothpicks punched through the matchbox. And the way I do this right now is I have it just sitting on my desk at work. So I just have a matchbox with toothpicks running through it, just sitting on the corner of my desk so that anybody who comes in my office says, hey, what's that? 
and then bamo, you know. Uh, he does give you a little carrying case so that it protects, you know, your pockets and whatnot from the toothpicks, uh, and that does make everything a little larger. How are the angles? The angles are great. Uh, I don't think there's any angles to this at all. You could do this surrounded. Can it be inspected? That is another part of the beautiful thing with this effect. After the trick is done, everything can be handed out. Uh, toothpicks, brass block, matchbox, there's nothing to find. All right, so how much practice does it require? Here's another beautiful thing about the effect. There's no slides involved. The gimmicks are gonna do all the heavy lifting for you. They'll do all the work. I can do it the fast way. The fast setup for me is to only use three toothpicks. Uh, and that's how I do it if I just reset it at work. I just put three toothpicks back in. Doing all nine takes a little longer and there's some extra funny business you have to do. But uh, yeah, the, the setup part, you couldn't do from table to table. You'd have to go someplace else. Positives. All right, so what are the positives? Punked for me. All right, punked for me does two things or has two things going for it. Number one, it's perfect. It's absolutely perfect, okay? Uh, this does exactly what it's supposed to do. It does everything it's supposed to do. And uh, there, there's nothing you can say about it. There's nothing bad you can say about this because the second thing is it's impossible. It is impossible. You are literally leaving your spectator with an impossible feeling, a thing that they know cannot be true. And the fact that everything's examinable, you've, you've shown them everything, right? So they've just experienced something that for them makes absolutely no sense. And that's how magic should leave people. Negatives. All right, so what are the negatives? Um, I said earlier that the matchbox comes pre-punched. It does, kind of. <laughs> um, I had to do some extra work, but Paul's going to walk you through that. Paul understands that your matchbox isn't completely ready to go. So he's even going to give you a little extra tool to help you get your matchbox ready to go. Um, it's just some modifications. It's just some get readies. That's, that's it. It's okay. It just didn't come ready to go. You have to do some, you have to do some work. Is it worth your money? Like I said, it's $125 and you might say, ah, that's kind of, that's kind of steep. But let me just say a big block of brass, that ain't cheap. Okay. That ain't cheap. And the fact that some of these items are uh, machine made. Yeah. Uh, you're, you're getting a great, great deal. I've seen other versions of these cost a lot more and I can't imagine this trick being any better than this. Who would like this? Um, I think anybody that's been looking for uh, this effect first, like if you've been wanting to get uh, toothpick through Matchbox, this is, this is a, I can't, I don't know a better one that, that you could get. This one's, this one's fantastic. Or if you just want to leave them, uh, this is your closer, right? You, this is your closer. You just want to leave them with their mouths open and say, you know what? I just showed you 15, 20 minutes of impossible things. And I left you with this, now impossible puzzle. Yeah, it's wow. All right, that's everything I can say about punked. Paul Carnato, I wanna thank Paul and mentalvoyage.com. If you'd like to purchase it for yourself, that's where I would go. Thanks guys, I'll see you next time, bye. Hey, and before I go, I just wanna let you know that if you're looking for a friendly community made up of professional and amateur magicians, just like yourself, be sure to check out the Magicians Forum at themagiciansforum.com. The Magicians Forum is helpful, clean, and you'll be able to ask questions and receive advice from people who know what they're talking about. Come see where masters like Harry Lorraine and Pop Hayden hang out. Oh, and of course, I'm there too. Looking forward to seeing you. Have a great week.